Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to wherever you are watching from. Welcome to today's video where I'm finally showing you guys all the Lululemon scubas that I own, which is actually 18. I honestly did not think I had that many until I started pulling them out of my closet. I'm not in my typical filming setup because I just figured this would kind of be the easiest way and the nicest way to kind of show you guys. I purchased my very first one in 2021. Some of the colors are actually not available online anymore, but I did go through my purchase history and found every single color to all of these scubas, so I will be talking about them as I go long and I'll show you them one by one. So that is what today's video is. I'll talk to you guys about the full zip, the funnel neck, and the half zip. So without further ado, let's get right into it. I did also want to keep them grouped together by color so we can see the differences of like the blues for instance, the greens, the pinks, the browns. Some of them do look pretty similar as you can see while others are very far off from each other. So just figured I would have it like that just so you guys could see the difference between all of them. But number one is actually the first funnel neck that I ever got. This is the white opal. This is what it looks like. It is a half zip. And then at the back it has this so it does not have a hood so this is what it looks like on again it does not have a hood which is a great alternative for those of you that think that the hood pulls personally the hood does not bother me on the scuba so I don't mind a funnel neck I personally wouldn't wear it zipped all the way up I do like to have it like this or you can go all the way down like this if you want to show like your sports bra or anything under like that but this is how I personally like to wear it. It is a more oversized again. These are like the oversized scubas. I get all of mine in an extra small too small. However, I do have one that is a medium large so I'll be able to show you the difference. This one is a little bit less cropped than the one with the hood but it is more cropped than the full zip so this is a nice in between also if you don't want too cropped yet too full length. It has like a massive pocket. That's what it looks like and then we also have the white opal full zip which is this one as you can see it is a little bit longer already i will also try this one on all right so this is the full zip i do like the full zips because it shows off the outfits when you're at the gym i personally love wearing it with a full java set i think it's really really pretty it does have pockets not like the funnel neck or the half zip with the hood where it just has a massive kind of like i think it's called a kangaroo style pocket not too sure but it has two separate pockets, obviously, because it does zip down. And then the logo is on the hood, opposed to it being on the back of the neck, like the funnel neck has it. And then you can just zip it up. Again, it is oversized. I get them in extra small, small. And also, really quickly, want to mention that every scuba has a matching emergency hair tie. So this actually pulls out to be a hair tie. Next up, I have a half zip. This is the Heathered Core Ultra Light Gray Half Zip with hood. As you can see, it has a hood. I got this one in a medium large. This this is the only one that I have in medium and large. The sizes for the sweater is extra small, small, medium, large, and then large, extra large. So I did size up on this one. I'll try it on so you guys can see that there's not really like that much of a difference. As you can see, like it's still super comfy. Yes, it is a little bit bigger, but honestly, it's so roomy, so comfortable. So I honestly don't mind lounging around in this. You can see there is a lot of space. I do know a lot of people too that size up for this. I honestly think that it's just so comfortable and I love, love, love loved this color. I remember there was a couple months where this sweater was super hard to get so I just settled for the medium large because I really wanted this color. It's a beautiful like heathered gray light color and absolutely I was like I need this so I saw the opportunity to get the medium and large and I was like you know what let's get it this is mine and actually this is one of my like favorite cozy ones to just throw and lounge moving away from the kind of like neutrals that i have i do like to explore with some fun colors as you can see so now we're going into the blues this is the powder blue half zip and oh my goodness this is definitely one of my favorite blues it's just such a pretty pastel light blue i had to pick it up and yes each scuba is pretty pricey at like 128 dollars each but honestly, like, they are so worth it in my opinion. I wear them all the time. They're super, super comfy. How pretty is this color, you guys? Like, oh, I absolutely love it. I think it's going to be perfect for spring and summer now that it's starting to warm up a little. Even in winter, it was kind of cute to wear. I know they have a full zip in this one, and I'm trying my hardest not to buy it. But again, I do kind of like the full zips when you want to show off your outfit. Because obviously, like this, if you're wearing a cute set under, you can't really tell. Whereas if you wear a full zip, you can obviously have it undone so you can see the outfit underneath and still be warm 
with that sweater over other than that you can just throw on a half zip with a pair of leggings and it just looks super cute together and like put together even though you barely try like you just threw on a comfy sweater i honestly don't know which one i like better between the half zip hood or the full zip i feel like it depends on the day and what i'm doing and stuff like that like my opinion honestly obviously changes but i'm gonna stop rambling because this video is gonna be forever so we're moving on to the next blue pastel blue i thought that this one that i'm wearing right now was actually the half zip to this one but they're completely different again this one is powder blue and this one is pastel blue so they looked very similar online but obviously in person you can see that they are pretty different this is more of like a baby blue kind of color where this honestly has more of like a purple periwinkle kind of undertone i believe i got this one for christmas and i wanted this one because i thought it was a half zip to this one but i was pleasantly surprised and i actually like this one a little bit more than this color if i'm being completely honest like this one is just a very pretty blue i've said that a hundred times but trust me like i just love this blue but anyways i'm gonna try this on to me it has more of a purple kind of tone not really a blue kind of tone it's still very pretty again you can zip it all the way up it has the emergency hair tie that's what this one looks like but again i just feel like it has more of a purple kind of undertone but next up is a beautiful beautiful color i saw the scuba go on and i could not miss this when it came in it sold out so fast i did not even blink twice before purchasing this this is the electric turquoise half zip scuba oh my goodness this is what it looks like definitely one of my like top three top four scubas i honestly don't know which one is my favorite but this one is definitely up there i love it it's just so vibrant and fun especially for spring and summer and then last but not least for the blues i actually did not not know which blue this was because there's two on my purchase history and I do believe that I returned one because they were way too similar to each other I'm gonna say this is true navy just because it was purchased prior to mineral blue so mineral blue came out after true navy and I don't see why I wouldn't have kept true navy if I purchased mineral blue I would have probably kept both at that point but I'm just thinking that this was true navy mineral blue came out and it was too similar to this one so i returned mineral blue because this one already had the tags off so i think that's my logical thinking and that's what happened just because they looked identical online too like i could not see the difference so i'm gonna say this is true navy but there was a mineral blue at one point my hair is gonna start getting crazy because like putting them on and off is just making my hair kind of crazy so ignore that but i'll show you all the blues together this is the different shades of blue again the one i am wearing is true navy we have powder blue pastel blue and then electric turquoise over here the very bright one next up moving on to green we have maldives green which this one launched in 2021 right now they have like a heathered maldives green it's not the same as this one that one has like little speckles where this one is a solid green as you can see there's no like little heathered or speckledness to it this is the half zip again very very pretty and my green collection is a little smaller so i just have green jasper as you can see so this is a difference one is just a very bright while the other one is a deeper foresty kind of green this is a green jasper again this is a full zip so you can already see the length for this is a lot longer than the half zip or the funnel neck again very comfy and again everything is extra small small except for the light gray one that i tried on third that was a medium large now we're going to be moving on to the pinks which if you know me i'm not really a pink kind of girl but not gonna lie i have been wearing this specific one a lot recently i just absolutely love this shade of pink i feel like it's a nice pink but neutral it's not too pink it also has like a hint of like purple maybe but i don't know this color is pink peony and honestly it is just so freaking pretty you can't tell me this color isn't the prettiest like purpley pink color i'm obsessed with it i wanted the aligned leggings so badly but they are double lined and if you know me you know i absolutely hate double lined aligns like i don't know why they even make that but there is a similar color called a velvet dusk now on the lululemon website and they have aligned shorts and leggings which are not double lined but i don't know i just feel like a it's gonna be very similar to this i guess i could mix and match actually now that i'm thinking about it might have to buy it just to see but anyways this is pink peony and next we have the famous sonic pink which is like everybody's favorite color for summer had to get the full zip in sonic pink they do have a funnel neck but honestly i'd say funnel necks are actually my least favorite of the three but i can't decide whether i like the full zips or the half zips more but i will say funnel necks are at the bottom of the line for me again not a pink girl but sonic pink 
is definitely a pink that I like. I do also have the aligns for that. I have a video where I cut the double lining because they are double lined. That just means if you don't know, it has two of the fabrics. Aligned leggings are usually just single fabric, but some of the lighter colors to make sure that it's squat proof and it's not see-through. Basically, just imagine putting two aligns just on top of each other, like wearing two black aligns because blacks are single lined. Imagine just putting two of them on top of each other. That's like the double fabric to it. I hate them absolutely. Like I just cut it out and it was fine. So I do have a video on that. I will have it linked in the description but this is the sonic pink full zip and next up we have i can't believe i actually now that i'm looking at this only have like one bright red color but this one is absolutely beautiful it came out a long long time ago and for the longest time i thought this was carnation red it's actually autumn red so this is autumn red this is definitely another one of like my favorite my top like three four favorites again i just really like the bright colors this is autumn red as mentioned but carnation red is pretty similar i did see it in store a couple days ago i wasn't wearing this one to compare but just by seeing like eyesight it was pretty similar it just was a little bit more orange in my opinion you can't get this one anymore so you might as well go for that one it's pretty similar in my opinion i just feel like with my skin and my hair it just looks pretty and just makes me look more tan so especially in the summer i love that but now we're moving away from like the bright colors and we're going to the more neutral side so we're starting off with the most like neutral one you can get is trench which at first I didn't like this one. I just feel like, I don't know, something was off about it. So yeah, they do have accessories in trench as well. And even looking at it from the viewfinder, I feel like it looks cute. It's just the initial like getting it where I was like, hmm, I don't know if I'll like it or not. But even wearing it now, like I feel like it's fine. And moving on to a sweater in a color that everybody loves. Every time I wear this in any video, everybody will be like, what color is your scuba? And this was actually one of the first scubas, if not the first one, I think, that I ever bought like this started the addiction and now we've grown and come a long way but this is the scuba that everybody loves when i wear it ladies and gentlemen is copper brown the copper brown half zip scuba that everybody will always comment what scuba i'm wearing when i'm filming a video and this this is it copper brown again i probably i think i got it in either 2020 or 2021 so the hope of this coming back is slim to none but if you ever see a copper brown scuba this is it this is definitely one of my favorites as well i just think it is such a pretty brown color as you can see it's just very pretty so this is copper brown we're gonna move on to three sweaters that from far probably look similar because honestly like i could not even really tell the difference between the three so i'll just show you all of the browns eight brown we have red merlot and then cassis so they're all different even though they look pretty similar this is date brown and funny thing about this is i actually almost forgot to include it in this video it was like stored away at the very back of my closet you can definitely tell the difference between the outside fabric and the inside kind of like fluff that it has as you can see it does have like a fleece inside i can tell that this has definitely not been worn as much as some of the other ones i have shown you it's actually very comfy very cozy but this is the date brown i don't know why it was at the back of my closet because i feel like it's actually a really pretty brown color next up we will try the red merlot scuba which this zipper looks very bright maybe it's just the way the ring light is hitting it or is it am i going crazy this one seems like very silver no, I think I'm just going crazy. Never mind. Somebody let me know if this is more silver than the other ones or am I going crazy because I feel like it's a little bit more like shiny than the other ones, but I don't know. Very similar. Again, it's like a burgundy red kind of color. Boom. I just changed into the Cassis one. I don't even know if you'll be able to tell the difference. In person, they look a little different, but honestly, like if I put this one on one day and then the other one the next day, I probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference. So the only difference is this one is a full zip, which is good because if it was two half zips, I definitely would have returned one or the other. I wouldn't have kept both. This is Red Merlot and this is Cassis. And last but certainly not least a black funnel neck which i actually can't believe that i don't have a black full zip in the scuba i feel like that would be a good basic staple to have so i have to go pick up hemming i dropped some stuff off at my local lululemon to get hemmed and i think i might walk out of that store with the black full zip don't be surprised if you see that in an upcoming video i have to pick up my hemming in i think like two-ish days and i did see the scuba when i was in store and i was just like looking at it and now that i'm here and i tried on everything i'm like you know what 
one more won't hurt maybe we should even make it 20 because we're at 18 so do i just add two more sweaters and make it 20 and go from there i don't know maybe don't be surprised if you see two more scubas in a haul but this is the funnel neck i do like wearing funnel necks so when my jackets don't have a detachable hood i don't like wearing double hoods if my jacket can take off the hood i'll take off that hood and keep the scuba hood on obviously you can't detach these ones but if the jacket does not have a detachable hood i will lean more towards like a scuba funnel neck that is my scuba collection thank you guys for sticking around oh my gosh i've been filming for so long my hair is probably a mess and everything but i hope you guys enjoyed enjoyed today's video i will have the colors listed down in the description as well as links if you want to buy anything if the colors are in stock on the website like i said i've had some of these scubas for like two three years so they're not on the website anymore but hey if they do come on one day at least you'll know the names and everything so check the description also guys we are so close to 13,000 subscribers i'm gonna do a giveaway for 13,000. i think i'm gonna include a couple lululemon gift cards or maybe like one big lululemon gift card i don't know let me know in the comments what i should should i do like multiple gift cards where it's like a hundred dollars maybe like three of them for a hundred dollars or just do like one big one i don't know can you guys please let me know down in the comments but that is the end for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to subscribe if you're not already subscribed we're so close to 13,000 subscribers i do have a lot of other lululemon content and shopping hauls for you guys as well as vlogs and sometimes occasionally mukbangs if you guys have any other video recommendations or want to see something on my channel definitely also comment that below i take all of your suggestions suggestions into considerations sometimes it takes me a little longer because it took me like 40 minutes to film this video and like trying everything on your girl is out of breath but i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys in my next one bye